Welcome back to Weeby Autos. Today we have a 1967 Volkswagen Dune Buggy. We have the owner's going to tell us a little bit about it. Yeah, hello. Uh, what we have is Drew Sedge, a 1967 Myers Manx style Dune Buggy based on the Volkswagen chassis, Volkswagen power plant. Uh, it's a 1600 cc dual port. We have the dual EMPI carbs. Centerline wheels all around with the wide five Volkswagen uh, bolt pattern. Completely new wiring, uh, front to back with a uh, fuse box. Uh, rebuilt alternator, the uh, new half shaft boots on each side of the uh, transaxle. New clutch, uh, chrome engine kit, nice dress up kit. It has the side pods which are highly desirable uh, with an uh, awesome paint job. Um, it's got the spotlights in the front. We have a canvas uh, top to give you a little sun protection uh, during the day. All lights, wipers, horn operational, LED taillights, stereo CD player, uh, aircraft style guarded switches, add a little flare to it, new plugs, rotor, and electronic ignition. Real fun toy. Uh, easy to drive, parts available everywhere in the aftermarket. And uh, when you have it, it's a, a clean Florida title. I register it at my Florida house for the main purpose. I don't have to have a front license plate on it. And I don't have to have those big window stickers on it. Uh, and it's right now registered through October of uh, 2016. Uh, just a lot of fun. Just a real, real kick. And uh, the Volkswagen speedometer, which is a nice touch. And the other gauges are Bosch, oil pressure, fuel quantity, and uh, voltmeter. And again, aircraft style switches, push button start, uh, black carpet, does have a rear seat. The speakers are, uh, are mounted on the sides behind the front seats. And uh, pretty much there you have it. You want to start In fact, out? we even have an Uga horn here, too. <laughs> little added touch. That's pretty I'll cool. go ahead and we'll start it up for you, too. You want to, you want to uh, just get a picture of the, of the actual start sequence with the switches? Sure. Yeah. Okay. To find out more information about the car, you can visit it at weebyautos.com.